13-year-old Choma never knew the joy of a brother or sister, though she longed for it with all her heart. Whenever I go up to my mom to ask, she said that she asked God that he can do anything and I trust in him. After her first baby, Susan looked forward to having other children. But as the years passed, her anxiety grew when all her efforts to conceive yielded no fruit. Susan was not in this alone, as Choma had her own struggles to contend with. When I was in school, I actually like, regretted it the most that I did not have a sibling, because most people would be like, my sibling was this, and if one of my friends, their mom just gave birth, and she kept telling stories of her baby sister. Choma and her mom prayed and trusted in God for answers. Sometimes we laid our hands on the baby's clothes, believing that she'll give birth one day. While walking on this path of faith, Susan stumbled over the 700 Club. Susan registered for herself and three children who were yet unborn. When I called her one day, she now told me she was pregnant, and I didn't believe her. The one that even made me doubt the most was when I asked her how, how many months, and she was like seven. I was so happy, I screamed. After nine months, miracle baby Daniel was born into the loving home of the Chibus, and Susan couldn't wait to share her testimony with the 700 Club. Susan's husband was not left out of this delight. His grateful heart was quite evident in his speech. Truly at the appointed time he did it without any effort of ours. Today, Chama is now a big sister, and she's more than willing to take care of her younger one. And she's grateful to God and the 700 Club family for creating a platform to demonstrate their faith in God.